out of Steve Jones. Actually, Friday, I know I said I was going to write a book this week. And I did say I, and then I had to change it to we, even though I was hoping a lot of people on the social networks. So I have Bianca here that came together, and she was doubting the process, and now she's creating some amazing things just five days later. So we're, I'm getting to hear this stuff for the first time along with you. So there you go, Bianca. And so our story starts, as most stories do, with once upon a time. A time when the air was ripe and ideas were fresh. A time when the sun seemed to lick your face to awaken you each morning, like a loyal dog waking you from the night slumber. A time when the moon was fluid with change, and the rise and fall of the tide beckoned us and hither us in, hithered us into the flow with a curling finger. A time, in fact, much like today. As the sun stretched its mighty arms, beaming with light, the darkness of the night seemed to shy away, tucking itself in the shadows of grooves and corners, until the darkness could finally be no more, and a new day was upon us. In the not-too-far-off distance, a sound started to emerge from the rustling of trees, past the leaves and branches, firmly wedged between a bird's nest and a tree trunk where an old woodpecker made its home. A curious sound started to come from an amber-colored hive. Buzz, buzz. The sound filled the air, rich with harmony. The bees were beginning their journey for the new day. And 